Darius Geis, my third faller here, and Adrian Peterson, just the, the corpse of him, continues to loom. He's got that looming, obnoxious presence, but this guy was a monster last year for quite some time. Predictably, the wheels fell off towards the end of the year, especially once Colt McCoy took over and defenses could just power, stop that run game, and load up the box. AP became nothing. But overall, the guy had as shocking of a season as any of us could imagine. Potential comeback player of the year talk last year. And he's not just going to fade into the night. The coach, Jay Gruden, already was talking about Geis as a three-down guy, someone you don't have to take off the field. And then he goes and signs Peterson. Like, is this just a handcuff? Is this just an insurance policy? Or is this going to be a committee? I do need to know more. It obviously could be worse if they went out and got a better talent than the corpse of Adrian Peterson. But we know Adrian Peterson knows the scheme well and thrived in it last year. So I imagine he is going to annoyingly eat at Darius Geis' workload. Maybe only a red zone role, but still, that's a huge part of fantasy. So it's not like I can just go all in on Geis suddenly after what was looking like a three-down horse type of role. And then, you know, the quarterback situation with Keenan that's going to be hideous this backfield just got a lot more disgusting to me and guys takes a decent hit on my ranking